Hello friends, welcome back to the Coastal Vlogger channel and for this video, I have something uh, different compared to the last one. Like in the previous video, I have told you, uh, I am going to do some other uh, videos regarding family only. So, this uh, video's topic will be the top 5 apps for FarmD students. So, I have seen there are a lot of recommendations uh, regarding your 4th uh, FarmD books also. So, that probably I will do it in my next video. And uh, coming up to this topic that is top 5 uh, farm D apps, not pharmacy apps, farm D particularly. So in India, the thing is a lot of people are struggling in some aspects to read maybe or to understand the topics maybe. So what I did is I have mixed up some uh, notes giving uh, apps with, along with uh, some uh, therapeutically important apps also. So please, please, please uh, continue seeing this video and please don't forget to subscribe this channel. Now coming to the first app. So I'll just show you the app icon. So it's Epocrates. So Epocrates, it's a general app uh, which gives you information regarding drug interactions, uh, drug related informations, uh, particular drugs, uh, different categories. Uh, subdivisions lots and lots of information therapeutical information about a particular drug also so why i chose this particular app at the beginning is this is a newly trending app uh, compared to some other apps this is a uh, more uh, popular these days a lot of people uh, are using this app for uh, drug uh, interactions and adr uh, knowing reasons and uh, when you come to fourth fifth and sixth farm d these apps become very very important so hypocrites is a very good app you can go for it coming to the second app that is slideshare so slideshare the thing is this is particularly for notes so if you put uh, like if you go to the slideshare app and if you put a particular uh, chapter you will get notes on that so these notes will not be particular to one particular university it is a random notes, general notes. So this notes, what it will help you is to understand the concept. Now there are lots and lots of apps, but this particular app, you get PPT presentations, which you can go through each and every time you can uh, try writing some of the answers from that app also, or uh, you can generally uh, use it to understand. So in some universities, maybe the teachers or the lecturers may force you to write their particular answer nothing like the, that is uh, compulsory obviously you can slightly change it a bit because this is uh, not some kind of uh, very high board exam or standard exam where the definition must be exact so i guess slideshare uh, uh, app is really really helpful in case uh, you go through it once now coming to the third app that is pharmados so PharmaDose is uh, useful for PharmDs mainly because lots of good quality notes are available. So you can go through these notes and it will help you to develop uh, your skill of understanding. Like previously I talked about SlideShare. So in SlideShare the thing is lots and lots of researchers, lecturers, they put the notes in that. Whereas in PharmaDose it's not like that. It's an app where uh, some people have come together and put out a notes. Uh, there's no guarantee that you'll get your particular notes whereas in the slide share obviously you'll get it so that is a slight difference nothing like both are uh, like slide share is good and I'm not comparing or something totally if I was comparing I wouldn't have put pharma dose in this but I feel pharma dose is useful especially for people who are uh, uh, not able to cope up uh, with their subjects or feeling it difficult especially in uh, family scenarios now coming to the fourth app that is Medscape. So Medscape is uh, another app which is famous, very famous from a long time. I guess uh, the moment I joined uh, this PharmD course, I have heard about this app because everyone uses this app. There is general uh, research information, articles, uh, drug interactions. Uh, you can compare the drugs, you can find ADRs mild ADRs, may, may, uh, minor ADRs maybe, major ADRs maybe and severe also. So lots and lots of information. 
there is not a single drug which is not mentioned in the med scheme similar to epocrates but uh, epocrates is little uh, bit of a standard one whereas medscape is little almost the same if, uh, if you ask me it is like this something like this so there's a small uh, hinge in between glinch you can say now coming to the fifth app uh, so this app i have not gone through uh, properly but when i put it in google it came that uh, this is popular among pharmacy so it's called pocket pharmacist i don't know how, whether you have heard about it i have not heard about it much but uh, i googled it out it was giving information regarding uh, some guidelines clinical guidelines protocols which uh, pharmacists must follow and all those kinds of information that is actually good uh, if you ask me if some app is giving like that information also because you never know because we pharmacians we get jobs such as pharmacovigilance uh, clinical management then uh, drug inspection drug analyst all those kinds of jobs so it's general general and uh, a lot of people uh, also ask me what's the difference between pharmd and uh, b pharm so there's not much of a difference the thing is in pharmd it's like you are finishing p ug and pg together along with your phd whereas when it comes to your uh, b pharm m pharm you are going to do it all separately and apart from that uh the main advantage of doing uh, m pharm is you get a specialization in one particular uh, field maybe maybe pharmacology maybe uh, pharmaceutics maybe something like that but uh, in pharmacy it's not like that totally after you finish pharmacy it's totally called uh, hospital oriented job work so as you know in abroad countries uh, pharmacies are more popular compared to here because of their prescription rights there soon uh, we may also expect our prescription rights in the next coming years so we'll hope for the best for the families so i would like to thank you all uh, for watching this video and please 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 do not forget to subscribe this channel and hit that bell icon so that you can get notified each and every time i do vlogs so until next time folks bye